Yo my dudes, welcome back to the vlog. So today, we are going to work on the EK again. Our plans are to spray the front grill black and then fit a larger Honda badge. And if we do have enough time, we might just fit the rear Mugen wing. So today we will be doing uh, the front grill, we are going to spray the front grill uh, black as well as we are going to add a larger Honda badge in without the edges and then in, like I mentioned in the previous vlog we are also going to fit the Mugen rear wing, it is very simple install, I'll show you guys what it looks like. like that so we have to hear what it looks like okay, so let me also just give you an idea as to where the mounting points are for the Mugen ring so Honda already provides these holes over here just needs to be drilled out on both sides and then screw it in. Uh, I do plan on putting a uh, metal plate um, over here and then putting the bolts on both sides as a spacer just to give it some more stabilization. Cool. So I'm just going to sit you guys on the time lapse and show you guys how to respray or spray the the front grill black as well as put the Mugen rear wing and then also just so wanted to show you guys what I was referring to um, the badge so this is a little badge you can find basically anywhere so what we plan on doing is <coughs> removing the edges and then just adding the big H on top Gives it a whole different look. Okay guys, so what we plan on doing is cutting the edges off and then just using the edge. So I'm just using a blade over here to cut off the edge. A Dremel might work a little bit better, but this is all we have.
Okay guys, so I managed to cut off the edges. Uh, what you would also want to do guys is maybe just get some sandpaper and then just make the edges a bit round like this. Uh, as you can see this is an old spec the grill that we're using. So unfortunately you're kind of going to see the, the previous badges uh, shape. But once you spray it you won't see it as much. And then we'll just basically mount it like that. Um, as you can see if we do spray everything black you'll mainly just see the outline or the H will mainly stand out. So I'm just going to spray the grill quickly and then I'll show you guys what it looks like. What you also want to do is um, just clean off all uh, you say oil. <laughs> hey guys, so you just want to clean up all the excess dirt. Um, you can use benzene or thinness, but if you do not have any of that, petrol can work as well. So guys, if you do not have primer, I would advise you guys just to give a light coat and then let it dry and then basically you can spray from there. Show you quickly. sunlight so we're just using a heat over here just so that the spray can set and it came out good and then after that we basically just have to add the badge to it and then fit it to the bumper and then fit the bumper to the car So this is the grill. So as you can see, you kind of can see the outline of the old spec badge over here. Uh, in future, we do plan on maybe just closing this, so maybe it looks a bit more clean. As you can see, it's as if uh, the Honda badge is floating as a 458. So yeah, it's going to look better if it's if you get a far view from it. Guys, this is the end result. This gives it a more cleaner look. Unfortunately, it's late. We were unable to do the Mugen rear wing and the rear garnish. It's a little bit of a closer look. 
hope you guys like it. So guys, uh, unfortunately because of time, we were not able to fit the rear Mugen wing. I will do that in the next vlog. Um, you know, it was just like you guys to comment as to how you guys like uh, the front grill that we sprayed black and added uh, the Honda badge. What do you guys think of that? Also, please do mention what you guys like to see in the in the future vlogs. Um, also, please do like and subscribe, guys. Um, also, I just there's another question I'd like to ask you guys is um, I haven't figured out the name for the channel yet. Currently, it's just Wang uh, underscore City to Track, like my Instagram. But I do I am thinking of a different name that doesn't include my name, basically. So maybe just something in general. Um, one of the things were I was thinking just of a like an, a number seven four nine three, which you do see on my Japanese plate. That is my postal code. So maybe that could also work as well. So please do let me know in the comment section in below. Uh, thanks again for watching, guys. See you in the next vlog. Peace.